Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The Natchez Democrat reported that on this day, July 4th in 1867, the streets of Natchez were thronged with freedmen and freedwomen coming to the city to participate in the celebration of this day and to attend a picnic on the grounds of Mrs. Nut House about two miles from the city. A boat had arrived on Wednesday and brought about 400 people from area plantations. At 10 o'clock, a procession was formed by members of local union leagues. Almost all men were decorated with ribbons, many carrying flags. Almost 2,500 strong, they moved up Main Street from Broadway in an orderly and quiet manner. The sidewalks were thrown with almost 8,000 people. The crowds marched up Main Street to Pine and then passed along the Wolville Road to a picnic ground at Longwood. The principal speech of the day was given by James Mercer Langston of Ohio, who had recruited soldiers from U.S. colored troops. He also was the great uncle of poet Langston Hughes. The paper noted that nothing occurred that day to mark the event of the occasion, except late afternoon rain showers that ended the picnic and sent thousands Thousands of people scampering home. I'm Cortez Adams. I'm a senior at Trinity Episcopal. This has been your Natchez History Minute. Happy Fourth of July.